Okay, guys, I wanted to show you how to uninstall and then install a newer app, an updated version of an app that you already have. Uh, Cinema HD, it's been giving a few people a little bit of trouble. Um, normally, you can install the updated version of an app and it'll install right over on top of the older version occasionally you'll get this to where you'll have to install you know you like say you know just for instance cinema hd you'll go in you know and they'll tell you there's an update so you'll run the update and you'll install it and then you'll go back in and you'll be back in the old version like you know it, it didn't get rid of the old version off off your uh, device so what you got to do is you come in here you'll go to your settings okay now my my device looks it may look different than yours but you know just follow you know the keywords you know settings stuff like that okay so on your device go to your settings okay most devices a lot of them have that little cog that little wheel up there yours may be in a different area but uh, go to settings okay we're gonna go we're gonna go to apps <clears throat> click on click on your apps okay and come down through here now you may have two two of these listed I did a while ago I've went ahead and I'm just I'm redoing everything so okay you're gonna say okay yeah I've got uh, cinema some HD you're gonna go in there you click on it you see you see the uh, version number now yours may not say version it may just say cinema HD 2.02 .02 or 1.7 or you know whatever number if you don't have this 2.02 .02, uninstall it you'll you'll come down here go to uninstall okay just like this uninstall Usually it'll ask you a couple times, are you sure? Are you sure? You... Yeah, I uninstall this some bitch. Okay, it's gone. Now, Cyberflix, it did this recently too. I, I uh, had to go in and uninstall the old one manually. Usually it does it for you, but sometimes it doesn't. Okay, so now Cinema's gone. Okay. Let's go on down through here. Let's go into file linked. Okay. We want to open file linked. Okay. <clears throat> My code's already there. It's the one I use most. 3580, 2882. You're going to enter that. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and uh, just delete a couple numbers like I'm just now doing it. Three five eight zero two eight eight two. I'm going to go to next. Now, some of you may have to hit back on your uh, remote. And done. Okay. Now, if you notice, it didn't ask me for my my pin. That's because I've already entered it in before it'll, it'll remember the pin for you until I change it but right now the pin is 9014 I'm pretty sure <laughs> uh, pretty sure that's it 9014 okay welcome please read the instructions please read the instructions go ahead and hit dismiss Here's the instructions right up here on top. It seems like I can tell people and tell them over and over and over and over. Even while I'm on the phone with them. And after it downloads, you're going to click again and you're going to click install. Everybody forgets the install. Okay. We're going to go down through here. You see those green lines moving across. That's just, you know, it's loading up the info of 
what I've typed in here. Okay. <clears throat> and I've I've uh, I've got a bunch of new apps. I'm getting ready to go through. Oh, I'm gonna try and go through them all tonight and get them added in here. Hopefully they're all good and all all run good on all devices. Got about five or six of them, I think. Okay. Whoop. Cinema HD version two. You can see right here, modified six two nineteen. Uh, I'm not sure why that's saying. I'm pretty sure today is the first, but uh, it could just be where the uh, server's located or something. Why it's the uh, why the date's wrong? Okay, click it once. There it goes. Zzz. Boom! It's done. It's ready. Click it again. Okay. I'm gonna click down. Now I can't I can't even see where I'm clicking. I just know from experience you're at the top. So I'm gonna click down once. Okay, there was the one click down. Now I'm gonna click once to my uh, right. Okay. Now see I did nothing's highlighted or anything. I just know. Okay, so now I'm on install. I'm gonna click OK. <clears throat> Wait for it to install. Do not open. Do not. It's it's best to just back out of everything after everything's done or after you do you do something. That way you don't have file link to open and cinema open. Okay. I think it's on done. <laughs> okay done now I'm gonna hit back on my remote do you want to enter a new code not really going to this time but we're gonna click yes anyway that's how you get out of this I wish they would change this I, I hate this click yes okay now we're not really gonna enter a new code we're just gonna hit back again keep backing until we're all the way out Back, 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 back. Now, if we want to, since I'm still in the list, go ahead and go on up here. There's Cinema HD version 2. This is the uh, updated one. Go ahead and open. Allow, yes, that's fine. Okay. This is just telling you how uh, Cinema HD doesn't actually have any of these sources all all cinema hd does it's just like a uh, like a search engine i guess um yeah here you go cinema hd functions just like any other as a search engine such as google that's all it does it, it finds these links sources whatever so we're going to accept blah 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 click down 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 till okay is uh, highlighted Click OK. Good to go. Okay, I'm going to show you guys a little bit. Okay, see this, uh, the little triangle there pointing down, top left side. Click on that. Okay. There you go. All your genres, kids, news, reality, sci-fi, soap operas, talk shows. I mean, look, here's your YouTube Red, here's your Hulu, your Amazon, Netflix. Um, so, like, if you're looking for a Netflix show, Amazon show, don't don't actually go to Netflix or Amazon app or whatever. You know, that's that's theirs, and you will have to pay them. Uh, let's see, I. Hell, I'll just click on Netflix. Just, just for the hell of it. Orange is New Black. I'm not going to play anything, but uh, let's see. Season 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Season 7 starts in July. Uh, 
I am going to actually click on one just to go across up here. As you can see, Season 6, Episode 9. At, whoop. I didn't click on 9. See how I dropped down on the play arrow. So it thinks I'm still on 1. You can see up there. So I'm going to go back. Now I'm going to go over. Now I'm going to click on 9. There we go. Down. On to play. I'm going to click on down. Okay. Click on play. It's looking for sources. Now in your top, top right corner, you see autoplay. Of course, my info is up there right now. But uh, sometimes the autoplay is good. Sometimes it's bad. Sometimes it'll pick a source that is not good for you. Sometimes it does good. Um, so if you want to use it, that's fine. I mean, just, you know, mess around with it. See how it does for you. I'm going to go ahead and click it just to try it, just to see how it does. Um, now, you, you don't have to wait for so many to be loaded up. So many of these links or anything. Um, another thing, do not... See these little pop-up ads like this down here at the bottom? Do not click on any of those. If any of those come up, just let it play through. Just let it play through. Um, if you can't get it off the screen after it's played through, look for an X. There will be an X somewhere, maybe in the corner. Sometimes it's hard to see. And you'll click that little X and get the hell off the screen. I know them things are... Well, it did to me just a while ago. I I, uh, I didn't let it play through. And I just, I exited out real fast. It did not stop. My phone was, I was totally out of cinema. I was on my Facebook Messenger. I was on whatever. And it just kept playing and playing and playing and playing. And finally I knew, you know, uh, it's coming from cinema. So, it will... <laughs> it will carry over into other apps. So, yeah, them pop-ups. Oh, I hate those. Yeah, just let them play through and then and then go back. Okay, anyway, we're going to do the autoplay. Autoplay will autoplay when click 10 links. <sighs> Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, I should pick one. Maybe at a back or something. Okay, nine, play. Okay. Boom, there you go. Now that one did good. So you might you might want to use that. Okay. Another thing. It oh shit. See this one's you know, usually these pop ups are thirty seconds. Yeah, they can be kind of uh annoying. But it's free T V. So and sometimes you can let them play through, you know, halfway or whatever. Like right now, I'm going to hit back, and it's not letting me. I'm going to let it play through. Okay, now I can go back. Back, back, back. Exit app. No, not yet. There's one thing I'm going to show you. Um, top left, three lines. That's your menu. Switch to movies. Make your favorites list. History, uh, what you've watched. Now, you may have to have a tracked account. Um, what track does, let's say there's other apps on here that uses the tracked system. Let's say you make a bunch of favorites in, in here in cinema and you go to Cyberflix. 
and it uses tracked and you're signed in you know you're signed in on both of them they they each will know what you've done in the other you know what you've watched what your favorites are so it'll carry over to the others okay um downloads i don't suggest downloading anything that's where uh some legalities can come into uh i mean it would only be a civil matter not a, like an actual criminal, you know. Cops aren't going to come to your house beating on your door to arrest you for downloading a movie. Paramount, Disney, whoever would have to personally come after you for downloading. See, we're not downloading. None, anything you watch on here is not saved. It, it just it goes through, and that's it. Okay, important part. Settings. Choose default player. Okay. You want, of course, the cinema player, it seems pretty good. But, MX player and VLC player, they're, that's two best players you can get. So, you may want to try one of these. VLC may run better for you than the MX. I'm going to go ahead and put it on VLC. And we'll uh, go back and uh, play something. Let's see. Oh, choose default play action. This is one. I change this every one of my apps. Choose default play action. Click it. No, I, I do not want. Let's say you pick the source. And then, then you get this. It'll say play. Do you want to play with subtitles? Do you want to open with? Do you want to download? Do you want to copy the clipboard? I hate that. I want to pick my source and let it play. So, choose default play action. Play. Now when I pick my source, it'll play. I won't get that stupid pop up again. <clears throat> Alright, we're not, uh, not really going to mess with any of these others. So now... Let's go back into, let's go to house, actually, no, let me change this. Let's just go to regular, whatever's trending, I guess. Okay, let's go Murder, She Wrote, seriously? Let's try a movie. So we're going to switch to movie, go to menu, top left, movies, boom, right there. Okay, and then also movies, it has the uh, triangle there. Now, this says new HD release. That could be old movies that they've just remastered. HD copies now of old, you know, old movies. So there's no telling what all is in here. I mean, it could be, it could be anything. Unless they've changed it. Unless this is, uh, I mean, because I know some apps I've seen. You know, stuff that... Okay, here we go. I was going to say, what the hell? <laughs> there's, I know there's old... But, uh... Anyway, um... Okay, and then up here at the top right, you've got your uh, magnifying glass. You can do a manual search. Type up whatever instead of just scrolling and scrolling. Okay. And you got uh, this little, I don't know, looks like a funnel, I guess. You pick your year. No filter. I know on some of these apps, I've, I've went back as far as, I want to say the 1930s. Um, Charlie Chaplin stuff. You know, there's no sound or no voice in them or whatever. Silent movies, I guess. Okay. Back out of here again. Let's go to... Shit. Didn't mean to do that. Okay. And now playing. Let's try... We'll try Aladdin. I'll let some streams pull up. 
Well, there's a lot going on on this. I don't like this layout here. Okay, I'm gonna. Now this is a very very new movie, so most likely there's not gonna be a very good copy. Um, I'm gonna pick one that's that's a uh, says Google Video on it. Those are seem to be just a little bit better than others. Sometimes you never know though. You never can tell really. Okay, 720p Vex movies, parentheses, Google. Let's see how this does. And a lot of times these, some of these copies at first, they, uh, just for testing that they hand out, they pass out. Um, and they're, for like whatever country, they will uh, sometimes have ads. So some of these are, you know, the quality is not the greatest. There'll be pop-ups in it. You know, that's just because it's a such a new, new movie. But give it, I don't know, give it a couple weeks or whatever. I mean, it's playing. I'm not sure how new this is. I'm... I'm thinking it's fairly new. Hey Google. It may not work while I'm recording. I don't know. Let me see here. Hey Google. When did the movie Aladdin come out in the United States? May 24th, 2019. Okay, May 24th. So it's been out a week. Now, so far, this doesn't seem too bad. Uh, yeah, sometimes it's just a matter of uh, trying trying the different links, the, the uh, different sources on there. Uh, let's see. Okay, yeah, this is VLC player. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and back out. And that's about it for cinema. Um, again, there's your pop-up. Usually that, that's the only time you'll get these is sometimes right before you watch something or right after when you're done and you're going to go watch something else. Not during the movie. Well, but like I said, that, like, the, you know, some of them, yes, if it's a brand new, they'll have little... Uh, info pop up here and there some of them um but that's just because it's such a new 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 movie you know and then you know give it a week or two and uh the other the newer copies you know it'll be the uh official instead of a uh, test version so anyway i hope this helps you guys out um if there's any other videos that you guys would uh, like me to do, leave a comment and say, hey, how do we do this in whatever app? Be sure and tell me, you know, exactly, you know, what app and what it's doing or what you need to know, whatever. So, and I noticed uh, I've had the uh, post turned off where no, where no one could post. I didn't mean for it to be off that long. I'm going to turn it back on. So anyway, hopefully I can get this video loaded up. So help you guys out. Also, I'm wanting to do some giveaways or something. I don't know. I, I'd i like to uh, get more customers for the subscriptions for my pay service. Like, I'd like to get, I don't know, maybe we could double it. I've only got... 100 subscribers let's say we doubled it to 200 i would actually drop i could drop the price i mean i could drop it five bucks for everybody i mean it, it's not much but i mean it's something 
or maybe you know i would be able to do more giveaways you know do a fire stick here and there maybe a six month paid service you know someone could win you know six months of free free tv or whatever uh and usually if you send someone and they buy a box one of my boxes i try and do something for you something either take a little bit off of the cost of the live tv my premium or maybe give you a free month on one device or have a, i don't know just whatever try and try and work something out with you guys so anyway i'm gonna shut this down and try and get it loaded up Ooh, 26 minutes huh. hope it loads up 